Yeah, anymore. Minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. There you go. You got the plume coming out the side over there by the VIF. Look at it go up. That is the SS John Glenn on top of the Atlas 5401 United Launch Alliance Orbital ATK. There it goes, taking supplies up to the International Space Station. Now, I haven't gotten the sound here yet. We'll get the sound in just a second. You can hear it coming across the water. That was the start. People are like, oh, the sound's almost here. The sound's not quite here yet. in your baby <laughs> there we go now this time there's not going to be any uh, SRB set for us to catch so we've been able to track these things far enough down range to actually see the separation of the SRBs um, today I am not going to catch a step because this is a 401 the 401 configuration it's got the 4 meter fairing but the 0 in the middle of 401 stands for 0 SRBs so uh, not only do we not get the big plume of SRB smoke off the side of the lookout that you can actually see the exhaust spreading out. You see how the exhaust starts to spread out? The atmospheric density gets a little bit lower, doesn't constrain that exhaust nigh, nearly as much and it starts to spread out like that. And that rocket's going almost directly away from me right now. Look at that thing, y'all. I cannot see the rocket with my eyes. It's out there somewhere, and I cannot see the rocket with my eyes anymore. What a clean launch. There it is. I can just barely see it. Oh, man. It's such a clean launch. It's just gone, y'all. <laughs> it's just gone. It is a beautifully clean launch. Look, you got a little bit of uh, you got a little bit of exhaust there, clouds basically. And that's crazy. 